May is Mental Health Awareness Month, and this week in particular is National Prevention Week, the perfect time to raise awareness about the importance of positive mental health and substance misuse prevention. Here from BH Care is Pamela Motti. Thank you so much for joining us. Well, thank you for having us. Of course. So I know that mental health awareness has made major strides, you know, in the past few decades, but why is this month uh, still so important to bring awareness to? This month is so important to bring awareness because we really need to put emphasis on our mental health is just as important as our physical health. And sometimes you hear, you know, it's time to get your checkup from the neck up, and it's so, so important. Right. <clears throat> and what are some ways that maybe our viewers at home um, can first of all, check in on their mental health and maybe improve their mental health this month. So there's so many ways that we can improve our mental health. One way is just to simply get outdoors and connect with nature. Another way is by giving, by giving back. So whether it's donating, volunteering your time, or <clears throat> participating in events that can help others. Um, so through giving, um, it's very good for your mental health. It reduces stress and improves your mental well-being and it helps others. So even just random acts of kindness um, can improve your mental health as well. And going along, you know, this, this theme here, BH Care is having a kindness campaign um, mm -hmm. that people can participate and spread, spread that kindness all around. So tell us about how people can participate in that. Um, so people can participate. We have hashtag um, kindness matters and you can go to our website. You could go onto our social media sites. We have cards that are available. So you might be seeing them throughout the community or you could pick some up and distribute them when you're out in the community to help people improve their mental health and help people just feel great for the day. Absolutely. And now for people out there who are struggling maybe with substance mm -hmm. misuse or their mental health, walk us through some of the resources you have available at BH Care. Sure. So BH Care is a comprehensive mental health provider. We're a certified behavioral health clinic and we serve more than 15,000 adults, children, and families each and every year through our clinics in Brantford, Ansonia, and Derby. Um, so if anyone is, you know, <clears throat> um, struggling with a mental health challenge or substance use disorder, we are here to help. We are available 24-7 with many of our services and we offer comprehensive outpatient services as well as other ancillary services. Um, and with those services, um, we actually work with the entire individual. So it's, you know, full comprehensive mind and body. So important. And part of BH Care is the Alliance for Prevention and Wellness. Mm -hmm. Tell us about in particular um, for that that part of BH Care, what you offer? So the Alliance for Prevention and Wellness is a regional behavioral health action organization and we are the prevention arm. So we provide substance use prevention, mental health promotion, some problem gambling, and we coordinate the regional suicide advisory board. So for folks out in the community who need resources, we're available to provide naloxone kits um, and training. We do a lot of suicide prevention training, such as question, persuade, refer, um, talk saves lives and mental health first aid training. So if there's groups out in the community that are looking to enhance their education, um, we could provide education on substance use and mental health promotion topics as well. So first steps for taking advantage of all that you have to offer, mm -hmm. what should people do? Should they call? Can they just walk in? I know you have many locations mm -hmm. around the state. So we do have many locations. We do have um, an 800 number in which people can call for services. Um, we do have services that are, are available and accessible. So that would be the first step. They could also visit to learn more on our website and social media pages about our services. All right, and very quickly before we go, you do have a special event coming up. Mm -hmm. We have about uh, 10 seconds here, so just let okay. us know about that event. We do. We have a chance to shine, which is being held June 3rd from 10 to 3 at Quarry Walk in Oxford. It begins with a walk in memory of Lori, who died from um, a tragic death due to domestic violence. And after the walk, we do have a celebration of fun events, including live music, raffles, games, and a touch a truck. To learn more and to stop by and come visit us, go to a chance to shine ct.org. All right. Looks like a really great event. We saw some photos up there. Pamela Motti, thank you so much well, for bringing for awareness to this. And of course, you can learn more at bhcare.org.